So amidst my little breakdown and my loss of not really knowing what the hell I'm doing or what I want to do or what I want to lead into and where the hell I'm at in life, sat back with myself and thought, what do I enjoy? What do I want to do? I do love Pinterest for fashion content and I also love Instagram Reels for fashion content. So we're like, why not make fashion content on Instagram Reels? And that's what I've been doing for the past like week now. I've been trying to post as much fashion content on Instagram as I can and it has been really, really fun. I set myself the task today of creating a reel where I actually paint some loafers. Now, I've been doing this pretty much all morning. I'm painting some loafers. I just thought I'd let you know in the discovery of being lost in my 20s and as the title of this little series is, I'm trying to figure out what I like and what I want to do and just play around with things. And now my days just don't feel as purposeless. Purposeless? I feel like I'm actually getting up and doing something that not only I'm enjoying whilst I'm doing it, but then I'm excited to post it and share it with people. Whereas before, I just weren't really doing anything. I was getting stressed out and I was like, well, I've created the same type of content since I was like 14, what am I doing? I didn't feel any progression or development. I know no one cares about this, but I care. And I feel like if I care about it, then maybe we'll find people that also care about what I care about. <laughs> That's my, that's my goal, that's my aim. Just gonna get on with it, but I'm finding my feet again and I feel a lot more creatively fulfilled than I did in my last vlog, which is always a start. Maybe everyone just needs a little time to just figure things out is what I'm realizing. And I always felt weird saying it and we're like, Byron, you do YouTube, you've gotta have your shit together. No one wants to watch someone's life falling apart. You've gotta be doing something meaningful and you've gotta be distracting people and you've gotta be happy and up and ready to go because why would someone want to watch someone else lost and confused when they're feeling lost and confused but at this point that's all i got <laughs> anyway i'm gonna draw my shoes and even that sounds ridiculous in itself but it makes me feel good i feel a lot better than i have done which is a good start. This is my reference image. I just put it into Photoshop and cut it in half so I can specifically just see what part I want on each shoe. This is the vibe I'm thinking. So imagine that on one toe and then that on the other. I think she could be cute, but I don't know if my drawing skills are gonna allow me to actually do this because I haven't drawn properly since I was like 16. But we're gonna wing it. Life's all about making mistakes. And f***ing up a perfectly good pair of shoes, apparently. Guys, it's so dark and gloomy outside. Like, it's literally pissing down with rain. It has been all day. I've been doing some painting. It's now the evening time, and I am actually meeting Anna and Haz to go to Peter Street Kitchen for some food. I just wanted to show you my outfit. I really like my outfit tonight. I've got my, these acrylic rings. I need to cut my fingernails and repaint them. Like, it's gross. She's nasty. I need to get some nail varnish removal, and I need to sort my hands out. So just ignore my nails, but the rings are cute. I'm wearing these trousers that I actually picked up from ASOS the other day. You'll have seen them in a bunch of my reels, because I've literally not had them off since I bought them. I also bought these loafers. Now, these are a bit of a, a risky one because they've got no real back to them, but I think the colour is beautiful, the shape of the toe, love. It's the first time I'm actually wearing them out, so I'm wearing these, these jeans. This jacket is literally just thrown on just to go to Anna's. And I've got this little vintage tee that I picked up in Newcastle from Wasteland Vintage. And this is the outfit. I also hate wearing jackets, and I didn't really know what jacket goes with this outfit, so hopefully this all works. If not, it's too late by the time this goes up. I've already worn it. Are you didn't hear it? No, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but what are you about? Hi, for Anastasia. Hi. You don't want me. Yeah, but what? What? I'm just filming like normal. <laughs> you're not fine. What? You're, you're filming. Oh, I know. I know what I mean. <laughs> you're a freak. <laughs> I know what I mean. Then what you're about? Because you're filming like your shoes and walking and stuff. I was gonna. Have you ever heard of a montage? Yeah, of course. I'm the queen of them. But I thought you would have wrote on. I thought you could have wrote on screen like POV come to restaurant with me or something like that. Oh, best day. POV. POV. I told you. Where is it? This way. You don't even know where you're going yourself. That's correct. I know, surely it's not hey that guys, way. it is. So I'm back from Ibiza. <laughs> Haven't slept yet. I was in high 12 hours ago. Now I'm going to You've definitely slept on plane. I didn't. I mean, how There's no way you've been awake all night. Oh, it is. Oh, I feel like is. I'm very underdressed for this place. Is. Why did you tell me? No, you did not. Oh, you're, you're, babe, you're wearing cargoes and a plenty of top. Smile. Not you, me. Oh, I was going to tell that. <laughs> how am I getting in that? It's the girl. Hi. <laughs> I'm so <Yeah>. well. <laughs> you sound good. Why are you giggling like that? <laughs> I remember Alan, I was filming my feet walking, Alan's going, and you're doing a POV vlog. Like. Look 
look how wide angle it is. Did you get a new lens for it then? Yeah, look, best. Look how zoomed out it is. I have a vlog, I have a share. I'll, I'll be honest, babe, I'm not actually You could focused. be a YouTuber, you. Do you think I could be a YouTuber? You, you could, could have. have. You ain't could have. Should I try and do an intro? Yeah, Diane, go on, love. You've, you've always been good at chatting to camera on Christmas videos from when we were younger. Hey, guys, it's Diane here. So tonight we went for some food at Peter Street Kitchen. Um, it was really good. I'm now with my brother and sister and we are going to head out on the town for some more drinks. We're going to go to Albert's. I got back from Tenerife last night. Very tired. Haven't slept. Tenerife, you I went to Tenerife last night. Sleep. Back again with the brand. <laughs> Hi everyone, sorry to interrupt this video. I very quickly just want to talk about today's sponsor, which is in fact Skillshare. Now, if you've seen my previous video where I spoke about Skillshare, you'll probably heard all this already. But if you haven't, I'm gonna give you a little refresh. So, in summary, Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of creative classes for people that just love to learn. I mentioned in my previous video that I were learning how to create content for platforms such as Instagram and TikTok, working with vertical video as opposed to like a YouTube video. This is what I'm used to. This is what I have done for years. However, my main thing right now is as the shift over to more vertical platforms is coming in and coming in fast, I need to get on it. I need to figure out how to work these platforms. I've always been shying away from it just because I didn't know what to do or how to edit these type of videos. I'm now actually doing a class by Ava Mickles called Instagram Story Ideas Growing Your Creative Business. Now, like I said, I not only needed to learn how to actually create this content, I now need to understand the logistics of the marketing side of things, which is something that I have absolutely no idea about. Now you're probably wondering, Byron, what the hell does this have to do with me? Great, you're learning new things. How can I also learn new things? Well, if you click the link in my description, the first thousand people to sign up using my link will get one month free trial and we can all learn new things together. I mean, why not start exploring your creativity today? I know I am. I know I am. And I'm lazy. If I can do it, then anyone can do it. And it's so easy, the fact that it's all online. You can literally do it from your bed. What do you got to lose? Do you get a three months free trial by clicking my link? Why are you not doing it, huh? Thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Um, and I'll let you get back to whatever the hell I would just say. Sorry for interrupting, but you could learn a valuable skill. So, it's worth it. Let's get back to the video. Uh, you got me, you caught me off guard. Uh, good morning, everyone. It is now the next day. I am severely hungover. It's also like three o'clock in the afternoon. I've just scraped myself out of bed. I woke up this morning with the worst headache. Humanly possible. But I said, Anas, we had a little sleepover. It feels so weird. It feels like I'm back in my old flat. Like, I can't remember. I think I slept at Anna's once. So waking up here this morning, I felt like I were in my old flat and then Haz was here as well. So I was like, oh, this is weird, girls. Weird. Anyway, we're gonna get our nails done this morning. My nails look horrific this afternoon. It's not even the morning. My brain said, people, papa, people. I'm glad I heard Some certain flowers just touched you. I actually got happy looking at them. Look, like, because they're the same price, but they're, I think they're beautiful. You're turning to Julie day by day. <laughs> <laughs> It's 
well. With our main Anna decided on every ride we're gonna pull a different face. So this was but I don't know if I got it. I don't know if I got it at all. Guys, I've been officially the worst person at vlogging ever, but I always do this when we go to theme parks because you can't film on the ride, so it's like telling you, yeah, I've just been on a, a bit of metal that swung me around, put me through loops, like it's just not fun to even vlog theme parks. However, I had such a lovely day with Spotify, me and Anna have just checked in to the courthouse. Courthouse? Courthouse or clubhouse? Clubhouse. Bestie, what is it? This is the little room, here's Anastasia. Anastasia, slay. How's your day been at Thought Park? My day has been slay. Three words to describe it. Um, slay, Bessie, and... Give me breath. What do I always say? Slay, that's all you said. No, but what do I always say normally? Give me, give me, give me... Benefit. No, it's That's something it's benefit brow. What do I say? Precisely my brow. Precisely my brow. How do I know you're saying you guys? Catchphrase. <laughs> guys, I've got to give you a haul actually. A what? Um, candy curtains. Yeah! Every single seat on the coach had one of these tubs of candy curtains on, but we've got another one. Did you get them at my like, county theater? Yeah. Every single seat had candy curtains on, and obviously they were a lot spare, but we couldn't fit them in our bags, like it would be really awkward climbing off the bus. Like we already climbed off the bus, like this, with all our luggage and Kyron's Krispy Kreme donuts. So Kyron, I do apologise. Did in fact steal those, but you didn't. Leave, you left them. So it was already very embarrassing. Would have loved to have taken home at least twenty tubs of candy curtains because they are my favourite sweets in the entire world. Jamie Lang, if you're watching and want to give me a lifetime supply, that would be gorgeous because. They're very expensive, and we have four tops, so... I'm gonna take these home with us. Oh, best is we can use them as a tripod. Look at that, that is a sleigh. That is a sleigh. Everything does happen for a reason, because if we didn't have them, we wouldn't be able to have this gorgeous We should do a mukbang when the food oh, comes. Oh, shall we do a little bit of a mukbang? I need food in my golf ASAP. What the bloody f*** is this? What Let's take you dinner one, love. That's a Ouija board if I ever did so see weird. one. Like, what is this used for? Why is everything in this weird decor? Why is the bin wrapped in leather with a belt on? She's giving <laughs> She's serving corset. She said, cinch at the waist. That is what I'm gonna look like in my old denim outfit. Yeah, For real. Soleil. Just a leather version. Hi, hi, thank you very much. Would you like the big car? Yeah, uh, yes, big please. car. Please. I'll get it on mine. Thank you very much, enjoy. Slay the world, as always. Give me... Bath and Trio! Bath and Trio! Hi guys, so today... Today I'm wearing this lovely Nike jumper from Nike. Do you want an olive? Have you got olives? Well, there's some of them, but I don't like them. You shock it on that plate for mummy. Eww! <laughs> 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 that was disgusting. You said earlier! You chuck it on that plate for mummy! Mm. Are you ready to slay? I'm so ready to slay, I feel it. I have such a vision of how my outfit's gonna look. Have like you not tried it on? No, I feel like I'm gonna like toad in the hole. Why have you not tried it on? Because I didn't want to upset myself. Surely it's better to upset yourself at home. No. And then if I'm here and it looks shit, there's what can I do? Just gotta wear it. The most important thing a lady can wear is a smile. And I'll be wearing mine and I've been proud. <laughs> do you know that wallpaper? Obviously we're in cold house. That wallpaper. Oh, yeah. It's entries that people have sent their loved ones in prison. You lie on. After being sent to court, from court, yeah. They That's why it's called the courthouse. Mr. Yes, it is. Don't read it. Mr. Yes, I turn it in love. You lie on. I'm not. That's what it is. It's uh, submissions. So you're telling me I'm looking at right. love letters to criminals on the wall. Yeah. Right, Mark. I started to believe when I lie there. Festus, we're ready to slay. I feel like my neck looks very tanned compared to my face in there. Um, this is not giving what I thought we were going to give. The shoes and the bag match. But everything else is a little bit of a mismatch. So, let's go. <laughs> I'm not actually 
absolute <laughs> spot to my camera today. We got up this morning, uh, checked out of the hotel and went to our management <laughs> office to drop off some flowers for our managers because they won a bunch of awards yesterday at the Bloggersphere Awards. So we thought whilst we were passing, pop in, have a chat, see everyone. We've literally not seen anyone in such a long time. In fact, the last time me and Anna saw our managers, we're having a celebratory meal for something that we were working on. And then the day after, <laughs> It got dropped. <laughs> so we were hyping it up. We didn't actually tell you what it was. We were hyping up that we were doing something. Celebrated with a lovely meal. Everyone came up to Manchester. And then we literally found out that we weren't actually doing it anymore the day after. So that was really great. We've not seen them since then. Guys, do you want to look in that shop? Oh no. Which one? Beyond Metro. The one we stood outside of. Uh, we're with Josh. When did you we're stand just... outside there? No, now. Okay. We're now going to go to Selfridges because we were meant to be doing some stuff in London today, which is why we came down yesterday. But all that stuff's been pushed back to next week, so I'll be back in London next week. However, we're going to go to Selfridges, make the most of today, and then just get the train back home. I just thought I'd let you know what we're doing instead of just filming my feet all day, walking around places. Yeah. 